Okay, welcome back once again, Cappadocia. Welcome back to EU4 as Spain. Still carrying on where we were the last time. Okay, so at the moment we're in the process of, <coughs> excuse me, absorbing Siena, which would be nice because it means we'll be able to upgrade these some more, get some more trade power in the node. We're already at 70% of this, so we're earning 400 odd ducats in there, which is nice to see. Well, really, I could get France on site and claim France's stone as well, but don't think that's going to happen. But hey ho. So, let's see. We're building lots of boats because we had to do the thing last time in order to get the last mission up. So, the only thing we haven't done is own this in France. But who knows? Maybe one day. Let's turn it down a little bit. What's going on over here? Scandinavia is being occupied by Russia. Well, Scandinavia aren't going to last long, are they? Brandenburg's still here. Yeah. Commonwealth are busy eating Scandinavia. Okay, so I could go for the military ideas and quality, but no, we're going to take the tech. Bit of extra shock. The last time we polished off just about every place with a cathedral. Now we literally have polished off just about every place with a cathedral. Where's he? Oh yes. So that's way to deal with those. What else can we build? No. No. Pirates are a constant schedule for merchants and subject enemies usually not a great victory only not only for us but for our trade partners. Our most recent capture of a supposed pirate on the other hand turned to a diplomatic incident as he claims to have been raiding ships on behalf of one of our colonial subjects. The captain represented a letter of Marquis issued in the name of the Emperor but a colonial governor, supposedly an aggression. I'm not giving out letters of Marquis. No way. New Spain is my most rebellious subject. Could become defender of the faith. I don't really think we need to. One of my generals is dead. Not him. He would never have one. Down here. Okay. How long before we can press buttons again? 77, so 11 years. Next year. Oh, that's not so bad. Right. Shipyards everywhere. Big dry docks everywhere. Yeah, we've got to wait until our building's finished now. Disputed success in Great Britain. That would be an interesting one because it would literally give me all of their colonies. I don't like the fact that Norway are down here. France I can handle, the Ottomans not really. Right, we need to get all these areas linked up. Yeah, I think it's going to be the Sioux that we're going to end up eating here. And it's just show name. Well, our buildings are starting to finish off. We have a big list of them. Mercantilism. 
buddy. So it's become self-sufficient. Excellent. The Ottoman already there. We're already over here. So look, how much do we now have in this node? 35%, so we're going to need to strengthen that a bit. Now we could quite easily come up here. The tributary of Ming, so there's no real point. France is already up here as well. So Australia, Australia is still growing? Yep. It's already occupied the entire of New Zealand. I think we go to the original plan, which was to expand Spanish La Plata. If they're not going to do it, I'll have to. I want to take the coastline, the entire of the coastline. Okay. Next squish coming up. There we go. More of that. This way, when the Renaissance kicks in, it will start everywhere that has a university, so at least it should do, so it will be good. Not oh, the Renaissance. The last one, what's it called? The Enlightenment. Probably starting in Stettin. All the way up there in the Baltic. Oh, we did get two of them. And we're going to end up with the birthplace of the Renaissance in our care as well in a minute. Yeah, that's a good word for that, wouldn't it? In our care. <laughs> Doesn't sound quite so bad then, does it? Yeah, we went over there and kicked the crap out of them and stole their territory. Okay. Okay, let's get that, that. Universities everywhere. Okay. Spanish Louisiana is busy converting people. It is pretty well hemmed in, to be fair, apart from up here, so it could be expanding a little bit. Oh. We are at Abming and Cap again, and how short are we of this? Ah, uh, not far. Okay. Development. I'll do. Bring it down to something a bit more sensible. There we go. Charters for you, new world charter as well. Support the clergy, emissary to the Pope, admin tech, diet, military tech, and the Cape Coast. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
God, we're miles over. I can't force them. Oh well, never mind. Right. So, I need a diplomat. What are my diplomats up to? Let's put him back for Tunis for the minute. Fabricate a claim on Palmer. So if we went to war with Milan at the moment, who are at war already with the Pope, That I love with Brandenburg and Naples, so nothing that realistically I shouldn't be able to take. Brandenburg and Naples would come in to help. I could call Genoa in. Do it. Okay. Time to go and rescue the Pope. One's out getting very close. Oh god, that is very tight. All my generals is gone. Let's go down here. Another one. They have a lot more troops than me down here. Where the hell are the rest of my armies? Oh, I've got two in Africa, haven't I? Whoops. Oh, I managed to click off onto my other screen. <laughs> Not clever. Okay. Don't bet you, but I wouldn't want to engage that. Nope. Nope. Salerno. T 
two heavies. Oh, that's a shame. Mine heals here. Yep. There we go, drive them out. He got there first. No, I got there first. Ho ho. Here we go. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna move it here. I am going to hold. Possibly not the smartest of things to do. Banner bird troops. Um. Where are my reinforcement troops? Fonts will come in. Nice, that completely destroys their alliance with, just with Naples as well. No, you're not coming across here. More money. So who's actually involved in this war? Hess and Naples as well. Hess as well. Chunky chunk. I just got stack wiped. What complete and utter horse shit is that? Alright. I have enough troops. Now that France is involved in this war. Down the Brandenburg. Okay. No, lots of wars going on all of a sudden over here. Basically, I don't want to be in the war with Brandenburg. I'm really not bothered about them. Why are they defend them anyway? They're the important. No, Austria is.
There we go. I'm fancy involved in any other wars at the moment. No, just mine. Bet trying to knock Vandenberg out of the war. Who are Rome at war with? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just Milan and Naples. Okay. But you guys can deal with that on your own. You don't need me. Solano was soon full. Let's go. Let's move on to Naples itself. To alleviate the siege somehow. Let's just fall three, two. Okay. Get rid of the show you that the transports just so we know what it is. Take the admin tech. Economic might be a good one. Innovative at this point. Yeah, we'll take innovative at this point as well. Still only at two percent in this war. To be honest, I don't mind if he takes one. So I'll just give it back to Siena in a peace deal. We do have a massive troop advantage here. Right, so he's produce I'm producing enough most of that. Twelve thousand France, just slightly more cavalry than me. I have by far and away the most gun, the most cannon. So far as using but then again that's probably not unexpected realistically. If you go by historically, France were very cavalry heavy throughout most of their time as a dominant power. Or up until pretty much the Napoleonic times, really. Upgrade that. Throw some more of these down. There we go.
Their infantry is just so damn good it's hard to beat. It's got there a bit too late. Right. Give me those. All your cash. It's a letter. No? Is he earlier? Yeah. Alright. So that's them out of the wall. That's a very bad roll. 7 versus 6, 1 versus 3, there we go. Vandenberg. Look man. I've got no quarrel with you. Just get out of the goddamn wall. Take it alone? I don't want a loan. The well, papal states are now scattered fairly well, but. France is busy swarming their way through now. Now I'm ahead on my check, so let's grab a couple of bottoms, couple of bottoms from your boats. Yeah, two of them should be there. Found these out. There we go. This was looking good now. Oh, with French troops chasing them all over the shop. Right. Some pip. It's going quite happily now. Oh, yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Montevideo. That's fine. Metzolo. Yep. Charter a new trade company. And you're going to be added to that as well. Have a little bit of pinch on rest. Down here. Cape Coast. 
Yeah, go on, you can have that. I'm not worried. And the rest are these ones up here, which were up a few moments ago. Welcome to Naples. Have Naples managed to re-establish their alliance with France? No. Good. Say my next target, because this way we'll be able to finish off our uh, thing with them. Our mission against them. I mean, I hope it eventually. Right, no fans don't got to control the chance answers. Hmm. It's only money at the end of the day. Three grand. Well, it's a good amount. It's not that much. Not comparatively, not now. Right. I would like Nevada. I would like you to release... Oh, they won't release for that. But you will return Venezia to Venice. And then you'll hand me plenty of cash. And your lance there. And pay his war reps. The aim here is to try and get a pretty damn big piece of steel out of them. Where might the army go? I don't have one down here, like this. Yeah, I've got three down here. It's good. We land all the way up there trying to besiege France down. That's not gonna work. Siege of Ferrara is over. Sienna has Sienna has a claim on that. Hmm. Well, in that case, that makes things a little bit different. Band of publications. How close is Sienna to being absorbed? 60%. So we can hand that over to Sienna. Any other Sienna claims around here? That one. So, France is going to hand it to us, we're just going to hand it straight over to Siena. A coalition may form. That's not my job one. Look, dude, I'm offering you a way out. You only need seven reasons now. <laughs> okay. Pull these guys back. Okay, so we to fall behind out uh, miles ahead. It's diplo tech that we need to catch up on. Uh, 
There we go. Blow the walls open. You put it across there, you go there. Can't because of the sea bell. Now they can. We're just attaching any busted vessels. And that's that one lump. Out to Milan. Time to siege down their capital. Finesse has fallen. Fleet is about to get crushed. Let's grab this guy. There we go. So I captured two. Oh. Lips did not manage to take Rome. Which is good, we've managed to secure that for the now. Thunderbug. You're willing to let out. Nah, no, I'm not worried about taking anything off on them, really. We'll just take your cash and we'll peace out. Then that just leaves these guys. Well, I could do them some serious damage here. <coughs> Excuse me, but basically get them to release. Shrink them back to pretty much their original borders. And obviously, with Savoy, that's a little different. Yeah, Innovado, I want Milan, I wouldn't mind. Okay, so Innovado and Cash. See what happens after we actually take it of them. Oh, they have a troop! Oh, look at that. They have one little troop. Pretty soon they won't have a capital. Go back to speed three. Is that literally their entire army? It is. I'm gonna go squish their entire army in one move. Yeah. That's ridiculous. 
Do 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 No, we're ready to go now. Milan's finished. And finally, pop. Okay. Now then, peace deal. Could take that. Everything's been working. No. That won't be doing. There we go. And Sienna is on the verge of being eaten. Milan is in a lot worse position. The Pope is still around. Like that, at the moment, this would not cause the thing to fire. It would retake Arezzo and Roma, add them to Siena. When the press is beaten, Siena it gives us a double attack on Naples next time round. Cologne. And the Platinid. We're already looking at some ridiculous aggressive expansion at the moment, so I think we hold on. But we have pushed Milan out. Which is nice. Okay. First march. Trade sheets just coming. Let us get one of our diplomats out there. I don't now need. Switzerland, Augsburg. So there we go. Switzerland doing it. Alsace. Aren't Alsace enough? Hmm. No, it's Lorraine, wasn't it? Yep. Okay. Switzerland, Augsburg, Ansbach. And the Papal States. Bavaria. My Megum. The Platinid. Ravensburg. So basically, it's most of this area up here. Banjo. Excellent. That's the harbour that I want. There we go. We're starting to improve our work down here. Spain, Brunei, Malacca. Austria. <laughs> well... It's good job I'm not planning on expanding any further into Europe, isn't it? Wurttemberg. Um... I don't know anybody up here that I'm at war with at the moment. Let's have a look. Creek, Chickasaw. I don't know where half these guys are, to be honest. Cheyenne, Miami. Nah, we should be fine without you, France. There we go. So, yeah, everybody in Europe at the moment is making a case against us. 
But we did eat an awful lot of land there. Okay. Just roll it down to the end of this year. Calabria. All of this down here is now mine. So yeah, pretty much the entire of uh, Europe is up in arms against me at the moment. The main thing I have in my f corner is that at this moment in time get out They're moving south. Yes, it's all right. Um, yeah, where should we go next? Let's go down here. Go on. Everybody's worried about me, but nobody's really wanting to do anything at the moment, which is a good position for me to be in. So anyone who is Catholic now knows that I'm not going to attack them, which is good. Doesn't include most of the people in the thing, but... Plus 10 to some defender of the faith. Got a lot of aggressive expansion, but that'll burn off in time. I don't need to go back to war in Europe again just yet. Got to move my fleet back as well. Let's move my fleet. Here you go. October already. Join the coalition, that's fine. Montevedo. Who else am I at war with here? Cheyenne. Give me that. Who else might war with? Right, so where are these people? The Peacock. What about that? There. Okay. Who else? Miami. Chickasaw. No, Miami. Cheyenne. Kiwa. Miami. Kiwa. Is that one? Okay. Let's intercept south, shall we? Uh, 
da da da. So the virtual being taken here. This is good. I need to expand California a little bit. I think California is doing that itself, so I'm quite happy with that. No. So what I want is you to stop existing. And they're about to get insta squished. Now you're a bit more willing to listen to reason, no? Oh, oh one. Prestige and Diplo or Admin and Diplo? Admin and Diplo. We've got plenty of prestige at the moment. Which is good. Are you a bit more willing to listen to reason now? Only one. Um. Yeah. So we're gonna need to chase these guys down, I think. Charging. Come on, hurry up and lock. Yep. There we go, Spanish Louisiana. Let's continue Spain. Oh, okay. Was not expecting that. Oh, I suppose it is in uh, their turf in colonial Mexico. Send our second colonist up here then to take this. Which yeah, which yeah. Matt Solo and Sam Pip have both become completely dumb. There we go. Up we go to Imbani. Gold mine up here. In Bambook has been partially depleted. Not that I'm that wide, I'm not making any money out of it anyway. Okay, Miami. Uh, yeah, yeah, bye bye. Bum, bum. Uh, better leave it be. They trust me implicitly, which is good news. Yeah, what I'd really like is for you just to see that down. If you could just do that for me, that'd be nice. Use your 17k. Let's get the burgers a bit of loyalty. Got a long going off.
Okay, back in in three, two, one. Okay, sorry about that. Right, where are we? So, purchase abilities. Well, yeah. Let's get some extra admin efficiency while we can. Why not? Invest in the innovative ideas. Yep, let's take the prestige decay. There we go. Yeah, Garth will become under the control of the burgers. That's fine. The extra production is really nice, and the burgers are now happy again. Which we wanted. Where does that come under? Which colonial area? Louisiana, so that one is mine. Uh, I want that land. Head over to... Spanish Louisiana. Get out. How close are they to accepting? Oh, not far. 62%. Who else is left in this war? Okay. Alright, we'll just take you out. I don't know when my diplomat gets home. And then all we need to do is go to war with the Shoshone. Sixteen more days. At least it'll be done by the end of the year. Whoop! Thirtieth, I should be good. Just got there in time. Another treasure fleet. There we go, found out more of these. There we go, squish that British army. Well, the rebels. And full annexation. There we go. There we go. Yep, basically we're quite happily just mashing our way through everything. And it's nearly the end of the year. Day first, and done. There we go. Another trade fleet arrived. <coughs> One. There we go, two more of them. But yeah, this is getting a bit ridiculous and we're doing well. So it's only a ten clear store. Yeah, they're still backed by the Ottoman, which is annoying. How about Tunis? Tunis are only allied with Morocco. Who else are Telemkin allied with? It's Timbuktu, wasn't it? Yeah, Timbuktu are. Timbuktu are allied with... Okay, interesting. So there's a few things we can do there. Mines and the Palatinid. No, they don't like me. Oh well, anyway, I'm going to leave it there for now. Again. Thanks for your time. I uh, hope you're still enjoying this. Like I said before, I know I am. We're doing well. Uh, we've got a large chunk of Italy now under us, as well as up here. I can actually see where this is. Spanish. I 
So yeah, be a cool demo. Maybe that'll give it away. Suspiciously, no. Spanish something or other, isn't it? I want to know what this place is called. Lugaria. There we go. Oh, Caliabra can become a state now. There we go. Are there any trade ports down here? No. Okay, just take it around to the end of January. Keep saying that. And then that'll be that. 29, 31st, done. Right. So, there we go. I'm going to leave it there. Palmer. Palmer? Why have I got to invest in Palmer? Aha. Been only Sepidus. It's because it's still not fully called yet. But anyway. So I'm going to leave it there. So for the minute, I've been Cappadocia, signing off.